Hi everyone. Um, today is Monday and it is our, the first day of our prep week for our size group. So I just wanted to do a quick video to talk a little bit about the meal plan and the nutrition portion of the program. Um, basically the size nutrition plan follows and it very closely resembles the 21 day fix eating plan. So if you already have done the 21 day fix or are currently doing or following the plan, then you can just stick with the 21 day fix eating plan that you are already doing. Um, if you don't, no worries. The way that the um, eating plan is laid out, um, it actually shows both container equivalents for people who are doing the 21 day fix or following that eating plan. Um, and it shows the actual amount. So if you don't have the containers, you don't need to worry about it. You can still follow the plan very easily. Um, so the eat up guide that comes in uh, with your size program, it is quite simple. And it, if you look just in the beginning, it is split into two different uh, groups. So you are, you will either fall in the group that is plan A, which is if you weigh less than 150 pounds or plan B, if you weigh more than 150 pounds. Um, when you find the category that you're in, it tells you how many of each colored container um, you get a day. So very similar to the fix. If, like I said, if you don't have the fix, not a big deal. When you get to the uh, list of foods, it actually tells you the amount as well. So um, when you keep going through the guide, it will list each of the colored containers what that container is, and then the list of approved foods. So if it's on the approved list, then you can eat it. Um, and if you don't have the containers and it says one purple and you choose raspberries, um, you just have to look on the list and it tells you that that equals one cup of raspberries. So no big deal if you don't have the containers. If you would like to get the containers um, because you don't have the 21 day fix, you can purchase those separately. Just contact me, let me know, and uh, I'll help you out there. But um, you definitely don't need them if you don't have them. Um, so the meal plan itself is broken down very well. Like I said, there are all of your um, categories listed and all of the approved foods and amounts so that you can follow it. There's also a section for your free foods or add-ons, so be sure to check that out. Any of the foods on the free section, you can have as much of as you want. Um, the tasty treats. Um, this part is for if you want to have a treat, you are allowed to do it up to three times a week and it replaces um, a yellow container or a carb. So you can check that out as well if you're interested. I also love the different seasonings that all of the nutrition plans have. I see there are a few different ones in here than what were on the 21 day fix. So I'm excited to try some of those. Um, the biggest thing with seasonings is that you avoid sodium. If you're going to have sodium, it should be sea salt or Himalayan, pink Himalayan salt, but most spices are full of just regular sodium, which is very, very bad for you. Um, there's recipes for different salad dressings as well, and, and then it talks a little bit about beverages and the water bar, so different ways that you can try to get your water in in a healthy way. Um, if you have trouble drinking all your water, you might want to try some of those. Um, and then the coffee and tea bar. So if you are a coffee drinker, you can still have coffee, you can still have tea, you just need to watch what you put in it. So um, I mean, my husband, Dave, he was a double double drinker all the way. That's all he would drink. Now he drinks his coffee black and he actually prefers it. I never thought I would see the day that that would happen. But um, here it is. So um, you are allowed to use certain things in it. Just check in the coffee guide and it will tell you. Um, Make sure also to check out lots of the different recipes. There's great recipes in here as well. Sorry for all the noises on my computer. Um, check it out. There's recipes that you can use. Um, like I said, it tells you all of the amounts. So um, basically, check out the book. Um, Shanti makes it as easy as he can. He provides tips and suggestions. Also check out the end of the guide. Um, he has some good ideas there for snacks and things like that, which is also nice. Um, the first thing you want to do is determine which plan you're in, plan A or plan B. I've also uploaded some meal plan templates to the files section of this page. So if you want to check it out, there's two different versions um, that you can use if 
you don't have one that you already use in length, then feel free to use those. Um, one of the best things about this meal plan and the 21 day fix meal plan is that there's no counting your calories, there's no weighing your food, it's basically just an allotted amount of food in containers. Um, you get so many a day, you want to spread them out throughout the day however you choose, and if it's on the list that's in the book um, and it fits in the container, then you can eat it. So it's very simple. Um, and the nutrition really is an important aspect if you want to see results in this program. Um, yes, the program is fun. Um, it doesn't always seem like you're doing a workout, but you are still burning calories. And to get your max results from that, you want to make sure that you're still eating um, the best that you can because that really makes a huge difference in your results. Um, the other thing I wanted to kind of mention is that your first week is always the hardest, whether it's as far as the program or the, the workout goes or the nutrition and the planning. Um, I remember my first week of planning, it was terrible. It, I planned for both myself and Dave. Um, this is with the 21 day fix, but it took me about four hours to do uh, because I was planning both of ours and trying to work it around his work schedule and everything. But um, as the weeks went on and I kept doing it, it got easier and easier and I got more familiar with it, and now I generally don't even have to plan my weeks out, I kind of just do it in my head. Um, it's not meant to be a diet, it's meant to be a lifestyle, and teach you really um, your proper portions, your proper types of foods that you should be eating. So um, I really, really love that that size is incorporating the 21 Day Fix eating plan into it, and that even if you don't have the 21 Day Fix, you can still, um, follow the eating plan without any problems. Um, the other thing is just try to keep it simple. You don't want to make it too complicated, um, especially at first when you're still kind of learning and getting it all figured out. Um, I think that's about it. Just remember, be consistent, stick to it. I promise the planning will get easier if you are struggling with it, and let's have some fun. I think it's going to be great, and I'm so excited to uh, size it up with all of you. Bye.